Hey guys, Shane Starr with DrawerMotorX.com. Today is a very exciting day. This is only day five of the HEC 1M8 release, and we already have root for this device. Big shout outs to JCase and Bopes for the root method. They spent all night working on this. When I say all night, they did post a picture on Twitter at about 4 a.m., so that tells you that they worked all night on this release method. They finally have the method available for release. Of course, this is a very simple one-click root method. This works on the M7 and M8 on Verizon. Uh, with the M7, you'll be able to go to Firewater and get S off. So uh, immediately after rooting your device, go ahead and try the Firewater method for S off, and you should have S off on the M7. On the M8, for the M8, this will work similar to the original Moto X root. Basically, what's going to happen is once you've rooted your device, it will stay rooted for the duration of... Uh, your phone being booted on. Of course, when you turn it off, root will go away until you turn it back on. So every time you reboot your device, the phone will be... Re it's basically a permanent root in that you're never actually going to lose root on your device. Without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the root method. Okay, so you want to head to the link in the description to bring you to this page. This is the root thread. And it says all we have to do is install the Weak Sauce app, run it, hit agree. It's going to re... It's going to root our device. It says that only the system XBIN will be writable. This is kind of what we did uh, with the Moto X on its initial root method. This is an install Super SU from the market. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and install the application. Okay, so we will install the Weak Sauce application. Okay, we'll open it. Okay, root is activated. So now we'll head to the Play Store and download the Super SU. Okay, so we'll just open up the Super SU and install the binaries. Okay, we should now be rooted. We'll go to the root checker and test root. And we'll go ahead and grant root access. It says, congratulations, this device has root access. From now on, whenever you reboot your device, once you're fully booted, give it about 30 seconds and you will be uh, rooted once again. So this is kind of a semi-permanent root just like we had on the Moto X. Okay, to unroot the HTC One M8, all you'd have to do is uninstall the app and reboot the device and you will be unrooted. Once again, big shout outs to JCase and Bopes for this root method. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe to this channel and give it a big thumbs up. Um, also, be sure to share the video. It helps me more than you know. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.